Both of these are going for very digital analog vibes. Both of them are going for kind of, you know, classic styling. This one, this is the Pocketbook Ink Pad Color 3. It's an excellent reader. This is a really focused e-reader, great e-reader, really excellent e-reader. One of the best e-readers I have used. Whereas this, the Big Me Ink Note X is trying to be your AI powered productivity device. It's not just for reading, it's for all of those things. And importantly, the notes is a big part of that. AI note is their big kind of thing. So features the Wacom EMR pen. Yeah. And it's an excellent thing. Okay. Love it to pieces for the Wacom EMR tech. Really like the e-ink screen. They've both got very similar e-ink screens as well. I've turned the smart light off here, but you could just increase that and decrease that by swiping up and down the sides. I can manage it. No, I don't want to turn it off. I want to turn it on, make it brighter. There we go. Brilliant. I really like what they've done with that as well. And I think just thinking about that, the analog digital vibes, you know, I see this on the side and I think there's a book. Yeah, it looks exactly like a book. I really like how they've done that. Showed that a little bit in my live stream with Brandon Voyer the other day. What they've done is there's an actual bit of the back that comes off and it clips into their magnets on there as well. So it's really, really good. And one thing I've already had a couple of comments about this already on the video for this one, the Big Me Ink Note X. Uh, they're not called an Ink Note X color, it's just called Ink Note X. The digital analog vibes are kind of broken by this pen here and they have the Bluetooth buttons. It's a bit unnecessary, I think, possibly to go with this quite attractive brown case. I think they ought to go for a redesign of their pen and you've got um, books are making a classic redesign of their pen I imagine they're bringing that out soon and of course the super note is looking good as well it's important for you to decide what do you want that e-ink device for do you want something to be your note taker and replace a lot of what you do productivity wise allow you to use apps and then you might need a powerhouse like the ink note x do you want something that's going to be an excellent reader and you just want to use it for that? Or do you, in fact, need both in your life? So if you just want to read one page at a time, this will reward you. You can't go far wrong with this if you're just looking for a reader. And I really do like that half folio design, which incidentally, that will be something like this on the Supernote A5X. 